Greetings everyone, this is Army Leader of the Nomad Clan Arc server, cluster server. Okay, so now I'm going to teach you how to make uh, baits for taming because this uh, the mod uh, has already changed the taming mechanics of the game. Okay, so now first of all you need to know what bait you need to offer to the wild creature your target wild creature so first of all you need to craft this taming journal i already have it in my inventory so you can use this directly in your inventory so you can see all the list let's say you want to tame a Allosaurus, just click the Allosaurus and you will see the foot baits that uh, this Allosaurus needs to be tamed. Okay, so can be immersive tame, uh, requires KO, no, requires combat, no, so this Allosaurus doesn't require combat. Yep. Actually, there are two Allosaurus. Uh, you can check the other one. Which has a complete. You can also use uh, kibble baits uh, for the Allosaurus, but it doesn't require combat, so that is good. Uh, normalize while I will. Okay, the informations are here. Okay, so this is important. The taming journal. You should have this. You can also place this in your table. Just press E on. Oh no no. Put it in your hotbar, then press 2. Since I place it in number 2, hotbar, then I'm going to place it here. Okay. So now I have placed my taming journal. Yeah. So this is your most important manual for taming any dinosaurs that, that are available in the taming journal next of course this is already what you know you need a mortar puzzle next this is new to you who are new in the mod first of all you need to make a food bait station and place it in the table you can also place it in the ground if you want it's up to you there are other uh, bait station like this cable station and last the trophy I'm going to place it like this so it will be much better looking it will not exceed the table yep beautiful so this is the trophy bait table station this is the cable bait station and this is the food bait station. So in the food bait station, uh, you can see there's uh, there are two folders, arrows and baits. So here you can make a different kinds of baits depending on what you need. Let's say we're going to tame an Allosaurus. Here, an Allosaurus. It needs a raw meat bait or a raw prime meat bait or a raw mutton bait. It can also eat a raw fish meat bait, raw fish, prime fish meat bait, and blubber bait. <laughs> what is a blubber bait? But <laughs> So let's find the blubber. I think this is the blubber bait. No, aberrant mushroom bait. They are, this is some raw mutton bait. I think this is a blubber bait. Botany. Yeah. Okay, I'm not sure what is a blubber bait. It's up to you. As long as I'm teaching the basics. These are just the basics. Okay, so now we're going to make a meat. Meat. Okay. Here is, you need, it needs a meat. Okay. Place a meat here. 
Okay, so we're going to make a meat bait. This is so it needs fiber and spark powder. So I'll be back and I'm going to gather the materials needed. Okay, I'm back from uh, gathering resources. So right now I will need to make a spark powder. Okay, let's make a spark powder. Then let's place all the ingredients here. So if we want to make a meat bait, so it needs fiber and spark powder. So fiber and spark powder. Now you can start making a raw meat bait. So I'm going to press A. So it's making around 20. 20 meat bait so before you need to, ma to make the wild to sleep to put to sleep but now you can tame them while they're awake okay okay I'm going to take half okay I'm going to return half okay so I'm going to teach you here for the meantime for practice. You can drag the raw meat bait on your number zero or ten hot bar, and if you can do this, uh, just drop the meat bait. But the problem is. Uh, you will scare the wilds away or if that is a carnivore which uh, uses this meat bait it will attack you so the best way to offer the meat bait are to make it put it in an arrow so I here I have an 100 pieces of arrow maybe I'm going to put ev everything so later I can craft more so start crafting a raw meat bait arrow. Okay, crafting it all. Alright. So now I have a 10 raw meat bait arrow. Actually, you will need more. This is only a tutorial, so I'm showing you a few stuffs. Okay, I have my arrow here. And reload your arrow. Uh, Load my arrow with the up here. Just in case you want to tame a herbivore, make usually this. You will need a berry bag bait or vegetable or whatsoever. It depends on the requirement. Just uh, follow the taming journal. Okay, so as you can see. You have uh, an arrow with the meat in front. Okay, you can fire this. Okay, it's already night. So I'm going to make a berry bait. With the same process. Baits. Uh, what does the bait need? Okay, it needs an Amar, Azul, Mejo, Spark Powder, and Tinto Berry. Okay, I have no more spark powder. But I have fiber. Okay, so if you're going to craft, that is how you will need. That, that, these are the things that you need. Okay, so you will need this uh, bait crafting station. If you want keyball, if you want to use keyball, maybe more. this is a more effective one. Yeah, use this. Uh, cable bait station or for the higher tier monsters that uh, needs to be challenged you need to make a trophy bait later I'm going to show you how to tame 
a higher tier monster that needs a trophy bait. Okay, it's already dark. Okay, so we're going to find an animal to tame. I'll show you how. Okay, so here we are. I'm going to try to find something to tame. To give an example to you guys on how to use the baits. So first of all, oh, there's a house, NPC. Oh my goodness, there's an NPC house. Okay, I'm going. I think I'm going the other side. Okay, hey, let's say you want to tame a herbivore. Okay, hey, let's say you want to tame a herbivore. And we saw one there, over there. Okay. So, I recommend you to use a crossbow so because it has a longer range. And equip your berry bag arrows. Okay. Okay, let's reload it. Yep. And now, do not go very close to startle them. Uh, they will eat your bait when they are relaxed. So, do not go very near them. And from afar, just release your bait. Okay, I'm not sure how... You will know if they took the bait by, I think, the, yeah. As you can see, Milk and Tosaurus is intrigued by your, it is already taking the bait. Go far. Do not let them. Okay, as you can see, there's a glowing smoke. It means that it is not yet friendly, so just keep giving baits, but don't hit it, okay? So, Milk Kentosaurus enjoys being fed. Taming now is very easy than before. You don't need to make the animal to put to sleep. And wait if the aura becomes uh, bluish, sky bluish. And it, from then on, you can start going near. Actually, you can tame a lot of animals using this. As long as you have a lot of baits. So all of them are enjoying. Yep, one of them are already in blue aura. So I can go near them, but some of them not, not yet. So just... Keep giving baits. Do not forget to bring a lot of baits. Okay, I think I can go near them now. Uh oh. What's that? Okay. Okay. You can keep doing this. They are already being tamed. Okay, this one is not friendly. You need to run. But just in case uh, you need to kill it, kill it. Okay, it's already near. Okay, let's swim. These are these Kentosaurus are dangerous. 
Holy crap. Okay, got stuck. Keep shooting it until it dies. This this is the one uh, that's why I'm telling you don't go close to them while giving baits. Because they will be Okay, instead. Let's go back to the group. Observe their aura. If they are all in blue, then you can go close to them. Okay, replacing this uh, to berry bait again and okay they are in a blue aura let's give some more just in case here okay they're friendly now okay start petting them press E see the taming effectiveness is already up I I think I'm going to tame three right away. Easy, easier than the default. Okay. Kent one already got one. I'm going to pet this. Just keep petting by pressing E. As long as you have a lot of very bait okay just keep petting them where's the other one easy easy taming uh, put bait okay put bait in your last slot okay you have tame a kentosaurus kent 2 Can three. Why? It doesn't want to get can three. This is can two, I guess. Okay, I'm going to rename this uh, options. Change name. Can three. So it's easy. Very easy. See, I already tamed three right away in a very short time. Just feed them and they will be good to you now. See, that was fast. So I hope uh, you will enjoy the taming in the Nomad Clan server because taming is quite easier now. You don't need to risk yourself on shooting, making them to sleep. See, they're also inmate boosted. Yep. Okay, uh, same goes to any carnivore. Except for the higher tiered one. So that will be for the next video, I guess. So I think that's all. Thank you for watching. I hope you learned something today. Bye.